Hi everyone, in this video I'm going to show you how to multiply. Let's just start by doing some simple examples. Let's say we have 27 and we're going to multiply it, so times 8. So what you do is you write the one that has the most digits up top. If they both have the same number of digits then it doesn't matter which one uh, gets written there, where. And you write it like this and you put a little times like this. Alright, then you start the process. You take the 8 and you multiply it by 7. So 8 times 7 is 56. And then you write down the 1's place. And then you carry the 5. So again, 8 times 7 is 56. You write down the 1's place and you carry the 5. Then 8 times 2 is 16. You add 5 to that, 16 plus 5, and that's 216. And that would be the answer. If you like, you can do some mental, you can do some math on the side. You say, okay, 8 times 7, that's 56. So we wrote down the 6, we got that there, and then we carried the 5 up here. Then we did 8 times 2, well, 8 times 2 is equal to 16. Then you take the 16 and you add it to the 5. So you do 16 plus 5, and that gives you 21. Boom, that's all the steps uh, spelled out. Let's do another one. Let's try another one. How about... 36 times 5. So in this case, you would write down the 36 and the 5 here. You draw a line and then you put your little time symbol. So let's see, 5 times 6 is 30. So you put the 0 here and then you carry the 3. 5 times 3 is 15. 15 plus 3 is 18. Boom, there it is. I'll show the steps on the side. 5 times 6 is equal to 30. So we wrote down the 0 and we carried the 3. And then we did 5 times 3 and that gave us 15. And then you add 3 to that, 15 plus 3, the one you carried, you add the one you carried and that gives you 18. Boom, there it is. Let's do uh, one more like this and then we'll do two digits. 59 uh, times 4. So same thing. 4 times 9 is going to give us uh, 36. So you write down the 6 and you carry the 3. 4 times 5 is 20, and then 20 plus 3 is 23, so 236. Again, 4 times 9 is 36. You carry the 3. 4 times 5 is 20. 20 plus 3 is 23. All right, let's move up to um, two-digit numbers. Let's say we have um, 57 times 36. So 57 times 36. So in this case, I'm going to give myself some more room here. <laughs> it's a little bit harder. We have 57 fun times 36. You draw a line and you put a little x. So it's the same. You do it the same way. You just, you just do it twice. So 6 times 7 is 42. So you put the 2 here and then you carry the 4. 6 times 5 is 30, 30 plus 4 is 34, so 342. Again, 6 times 7 is 42, we wrote down the 2, we carried the 4. 6 times 5 is 30, 30 plus 4 is 34. So now what we do is we do the 3, but now I'm going to write it, I'm going to write the result in a different place, watch this. 3 times 7 is, I'm going to cross this out so it doesn't get confusing, 3 times 7 is 21. I'm going to put the 1 here. You see, I didn't put it under the 2. You put it next to it, under the 3, okay? See how it's under the 3. So 3 times 7 is 21. You carry the 2. 3 times 5 is 15, plus 2 is 17. And then you draw a line like this. You put a plus sign, and then you put a 0 here, okay? And then you just add. 2 plus 0 is 2. 4 plus 1 is 5. 3 plus 7 is 11. Carry the 1. 1 plus 1 is 2. 2, 1, 5, 2. I feel like I messed up somewhere. Uh, I did. 3 plus 7 is 10. Carry the 1. Yeah, we're good. Okay. 2 plus 0 is 2. 4 plus 1 is 5. 3 plus 7 is 10. So you put the 0 there. Carry the 1. 1 plus 1 is 2. Okay, good. Good save. <laughs> Felt off. All right, let, let's, try, uh, let's try one more. How about, um, let's do 67 
times 27. So we have 6, 7 times 2, 7. You draw a line and you put an X. All right, let's do it. So we have 7 times 7, that's 49. So you write down the 9 and then you carry the 4. 7 times 6 is 42. 42 plus 4 is 46. Boom, there it is. Let's check that. 7 times 7 is 49. We wrote down the 9, carry the 4. 7 times 6 is 42. 42 plus 4 is 46. Then we go to the 2. And remember, when you do this one, you write the result under the 2. So you line them up. So 2 times 7 is 14. So you write down the 4. And then you carry the 1. Again, 2 times 7 is 14, carry the 1. 2 times 6 is 12, 12 plus 1 is 13. You draw your line, you put a plus sign, you put a 0 here. 9 plus 0 is 9. 6 plus 4 is 10, so you write down your 0, carry the 1. 1 plus 4 is 5, plus 3 is 8, bring down your 1, 1, 8, 0, 9. And I'm, I'm going to check this last one in my calculator. I'm going to cheat, even though this whole video has been you know, doing things by hand. Success. It is correct. <laughs> it's very easy um, to mess up in these problems. So hopefully this video uh, has helped you refresh your memory or maybe just learned for the first time ever how to multiply. Good luck.